Shorty roll me smooth as my Mercedes ride. Huh? No love, cry when only babies die. And when I go that cash, you better cost a hundred thousand. I pray to God I look my killer in his eyes. Snatch his soul out his shirt, just take him for that. Yo, what's up guys and welcome back to a brand new YouTube video and today in this video we're doing chapter 292 Black Clover Manga Prediction. If you're new around here and you never heard my name before, my name is Soyz, I do anime related content on this channel. If you like Black Clover, My Academia, Boruto and Demon Slayer and many more anime slash manga content on this channel, this channel is for you. I do theories, discussion, chat reviews, anime reviews, I do all anime reviews here and there and if you like that type of video make sure you subscribe hit that like button and also turn the bell notification you never miss a juicy video every time i upload on this channel so let's get straight on the video so we're talking about chapter 292 of the black clover prediction and oh my god this chapter and the next chapter could be anything related to dante versus magmas fight or we will get someone out. I believe I we're gonna get Magma versus Dante for a couple chapters, and then we're gonna move into someone else's territory or fight. It be could it could be Fanica, it could be um, Sanon or Sinon, or it could be uh, Noel and the Heart Kingdom, or it could be Morris itself unlocking the second gate of the Trail Cliff off. Or speaking to Yami and William because we haven't seen Yami and William interacting with each other or interacting at all in the tree of cliff off in the Spade Kingdom. We have seen them glimpse of them of their faces or their heads or their eyes, but we haven't seen them interacting to each other or interacting with Morris. So this is be a good opportunity or good thing to see that we need an update of Yami and William's situation in the tree of cliff off and what is happening. In them, how do they feel? What's their pain they feeling and stuff like that? And I'm related to see that. And I want to see more of Morris. Morris is a big mysterious player in this arc. We don't know how he met the Dark Triad, we don't know the Dark Triad past, and we don't know the demon possessing or Morris has possessed that demon at all. We don't know anything about Morris in this arc. We don't know, even know, we don't know even Morris it's himself. We all know. He was blind born and he's done human experiments. We don't know what he has he done in the future of Black Clover or in the past in the Black Clover. So that is very interesting to see and learn more about Morris. So enough of the talk about Morris. We're going to talk about Dante versus Magma and Zoro. So Zoro we have got none spotlight in last chapter but I believe he will get spotlight at the end of this chapter or chapter 293 or 94 and that is going to be interesting to see what's going on we did see a combo spell in chapter 291 with Zoro and Magma because Magma did the chain magic and I've forgotten the magic climb it's called but someone else is going to comment down below and like tell me and then we saw Zoro's spell when Magma poured the chain out so we don't know if if Zoro placed loads of spells in the Dark Triad place where they're standing or near the ritual and Zoro is the type of person who will play his spells where people are like ready to place them. He did that in the tuning exams arc. No, it's not called the tuning, it's called the magic time, magic exams arc. He did that in the magic exams arc and so it'd be really good if Zoro does that in the spade arc and I think we're gonna, he's gonna activate his super duper spell that he had learned in six months training art. He knows he isn't strong enough, but we're gonna see a super duper spell that will Magma will reveal to us in later on in the story, and that will affect the Dark Shroud, Morris, and many more people in the kingdom. It could be the demons, it could be the Dark Disciples, it could be the people in the Clover Kingdom, and the, we don't know. We don't know about Sora at the moment, but Dante versus Magma. We never thought, we never thought that Dante and Magma will happen. We never thought this, and I didn't thought that it as well. I think that would never, never happen in my lifetime. But we all know that Dante will overcome Magma. But if Magma pulls up and overcomes Dante, that's mind blowing, but I don't think Tabata will do that because we need to see the Dark Tribe winning this art and winning this war and the Clover Kingdom, Diamond Kingdom, Bay Kingdom losing against this war because this would be a great like matchup and great arc, how the arc will end in that. I have a different video plan how 
how the arc will end. It's gonna be an updated version like they did a few like ages ago, but I mean, it's gonna be interesting to see what how this arc will end and stuff like that. But we we don't know. We don't know at all. So let's talk about Asta and Natchez situation at the moment. I'm gonna be talking about every single person in this chapter that can relate in chapter 292 and beyond. So Asta and Nacht. So Nacht wants to fight Morris. He, he tried to fight Morris but the twin devils got in the way so he had to do a diversion, take the twin devils away from Jack and Dante and Natch did lose. We did learn about his backstory and how Asta reminded of his brother, but it isn't his brother. But then Asta can't do Devil Union every 30 minutes. So that's a big, big, big disadvantage right there. But there's one advantage that Asta has is the anti magic sword. So we've got the free anti magic sword and we have the demon slasher sword. So that is good opportunity. Like, actually, that's really good, good advantage right there because we can see more spells with the free anti magic demon sword. And we don't know if that will happen, if that not, or he could do the same spells that he has already learned or you can have a new spell that um Libe can teach Asta like oh read this spell in the grimoire say this language and you get a gain a new spell or something like that but that's just, like that's something impossible or not impossible but we don't know how this situation will go and let's talk about Noel. Noel and the Heart Kingdom. We haven't seen Noel and the Heart King Kingdom for a quite a while and I want to see them more. I want to see there are more flashbacks to the Dryad that we got learned in the new Owl Village. I want to learn about her about more. I think that Noelle and who else trained Ultimate Magic will go back to the Dry Hat Ultra Magic because we know that the Clover Kingdom, the Diamond Kingdom, and the Spade Kingdom will lose against the Dark Triad and the Demons and Morris itself. So I think we need to we need like a training arc after this, the Spade arc. So that'd be like a great thing to see because they did confirm that we are overseas arc so that could be the training arc or the overseas arc but or this the Spade Kingdom being a long ass arc maybe like over 200 chapters and that no well not very will proceed and progress with their auto magic during that arc and learn new stuff that the elves didn't learn or couldn't do or didn't have the time to do because they died or they didn't master the power or didn't train often with the power that much. So that's a good thing right there. So the Black Bulls. The Black Bulls. We did see them in the Black Bulls when Asta arrived to save Nark. We saw Finral and the other Black Bulls. So I wanted to see what they would do in that 2D training they do. So they'd be interested in see what they do and how they do it. So that's a good opportunity there. I didn't I have no prediction what they would do, but I wanted to know what they would what they were doing in them two days. So yeah, that's my predictions of this chapter. If you like this video, make sure you like, subscribe, turn on that notification, never miss a video. My name is Lloyds, and see you in the next video. Peace out, guys. Slick talker since a jet. When it's time, all the time, oh, yeah. Look at the way that I move, swag. Disrespectful and I'm rude, okay. I had cocaine in the school. Uh.